Hi, I'm Francesco Doddo and today I'm here with Uchishiba-san to show you solutions for uh, robots using ST products. Uh, specifically today we're going to walk into technologies like microcontrollers, sensors, motor drivers and connectivity. And uh, this robot that we use as a showcase of those products will use more than 40 products, ST products, uh, for the solution. We'll start with some of the demo and uh, Uchishiba-san will show the first demo using our time of flight technology just to start, stop and direct the motor. So the robot has two time of flight sensors on each side and while the robot is walking we can change the direction of the robot just getting closer to the time of flight sensor. We can make it turn left or right and we can even stop it through a time of flight sensor that is actually in front of the robot. Then the second demo that we want to show with this robot is actually uh, uh, the arm extension. So we have two time of flight sensors on each arm and we're going to make sure that the distance between the arms and the hands of Ushishiba-san is always the same. So the time of flight sensors can have a resolution of 10 millimeters so we can precisely set the distance of the sensor uh, with uh, the, arm, uh, the arm of Ushishiba-san. Then the third demo that we want to show is what we call the temperature detection. So the robot has a Wi-Fi module, so it's talking to the cloud using a Wi-Fi connection and uh, we can monitor each time the temperature of the robot. For example, right now we can see that the temperature of the robot is 29.7 degree. We are using a module within the robot that's called the sensor tile, the feature lot of sensors inside. And uh, if we turn on a fan that is right in front of the robot, we will see that the temperature that uh, is shown into the cloud in our uh, graphical user interface is going to change. You see actually the temperature is going up and also an LED in the front of the robot is going to show that we overcome a certain threshold. Now if we turn off the fan we will see that that temperature is going to go back to normal and the LED is going to turn off. The third demo that we want to show is actually what we call the pressure sensor demo. So within uh, the sensor tile module that is equipped in front of the module, we have a pressure sensor. We use, we use that pressure sensor to measure the barometric pressure, the atmospheric pressure of the robot, and so we can uh, precisely tell the height of the robot with an accuracy that can go up to a few centimeters. So for example, if we move up the robot, once we overcome that threshold, the LED is going to go, it's going to turn uh, green thanks to the signal that comes directly from the pressure sensor. If we go down, the LED is going to turn back to blue, signaling that, of course, we are moving in height the, the object. Now, the fourth demo that uh, we want to show is the image projection. The, the robot is also equipped with a Pico projector, a tiny projector from ST Microelectronics that allows to show videos or images on a surface. And that's exactly what we're showing uh, in this moment. So there, there is an image um, picture that we're showing on, on the wall. As you can see, the um, uh, resolution is uh, very good of, of the device. And uh, also the form factor of the Pico projector is very small. That means that you can integrate this in applications like small robots, domestic robots, but also smartphones and um, uh, wearable devices. The last demo that we want to show is actually a demo where we are using again the time of fli flight sensor, which Shiba-san is going to use gesture in order to control the robot. So right now we're making the robot turning left or right, simply using gestures on the, the time of flight. And as you can see, the robot is actually moving in the direction that Uchi Shiba-san is um, using with his, with his gesture. So now I think it's time to say bye to the robot and thank you for having uh, this demo with us. Thank you, everybody. You can find more information about the ST products on uh, www.st.com and feel free to contact us. Thank you again.